With the statewide mask mandate ending next month, counties are now determining if they need their own mandates. Weber County officials discussed the issue today. Fox 13's Ben Winslow has that story from Ogden. Weber County may be the first government in the state to consider what to do now that the governor has signed the COVID-19 endgame into law, lifting the statewide mask mandate next month. I think people are hungry to get the masks off. Weber County commissioners were briefed by the local health department on whether or not to issue a new mask mandate. But we're in a different place today than we were a year ago. Uh, with coronavirus. More and more people are getting vaccinated. Over 25% of Weber and Morgan County residents have gotten at least one dose and businesses have adjusted to protect their employees and customers. I'm hesitant today to say, you know, that we, I, I think we should or we shouldn't do a mask mandate on, as a county level. I really want to wait as we get closer to April 10th, we, you know, about two more weeks to look at the numbers and see where they're at, see what our infection rates are. Governor Spencer Cox signed the bill nicknamed the COVID-19 Endgame. It lifts the statewide mask mandate on April 10th. Masks will still be required for schools and any gathering over 50 people. It also allows local governments to decide whether or not to issue their own and counties across the state are now considering it. Weber County commissioners are weighing the data. Right now, their case rate is still higher, but they're below other thresholds. If the trend were on, mm -hmm. stayed the same, would we reach 102 weeks or is it flatter? Um, it's flatter than that. Meanwhile, the Utah Department of Health issued this new public health order that expires on April 9th, the day before the mask mandate is lifted. The state health department says it's largely unchanged and is designed to serve as a bridge to April 10th when the mask requirement expires, but does require testing for one-time extracurricular events in schools if the event is indoors. Weber County commissioners are considering whether to issue a new mask mandate just for Weber County facilities or whether to issue one for all residents. I think we've got an inclination. Uh, again, that's not a formal vote that uh, our businesses have done a great job in uh, wearing masks and making sure that their customers were protected. And quite frankly, we trust our businesses. And for government to come down on the side that say, look, we don't trust you, we're gonna require that, is uh, in my opinion, a stretch for Weber County. Weber County commissioners have decided to come back the Monday after the statewide mask mandate is issued to decide if they need to issue a new one. In Ogden, Ben Winslow, Fox 13 News, Utah.